Hey, it's Tanya, and yes, look at that. The September hip kits have arrived in sunny South Africa, and because I get mine quite a lot later than a lot of the other design team members do, you will have already seen a whole bunch of unboxings. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an inboxing. I'm going to take my iris container. See, it's all empty, ready to go. Yep, super exciting. And I'm going to put it in there and I'm going to take you along for the ride. So let me unpack everything so we don't have the crinkle, which, you know, can be a little annoying. And we will start to put it all together. Great. See you just now. Right, I'm back. But what I like to do first is I like to look at the papers and kind of ooh and ah over them. Oh, look. Can you see that gold? And then, because I get the patterned paper add-on, which, as you will know, is a very reasonable price and extends your kit tremendously, like an elastic, you know, you get the elastic and it extends it tremendously. So then what I do is I like to have all of them in, you know, like this. So I can see both sides when I am looking through the papers, and this is going to get complicated because I'm going to run out of space. So, let's keep going. Isn't that pretty? Wow, I saw Missy do an amazing layout with that paper. Yeah, so nice. Oh, look at the blue. Reminds me of a tablecloth or a picnic. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's, let's just get a move on Tanya, otherwise this is going to become very, very long-winded. Nobody wants long-winded Tanya, because, well, yeah, she starts saying ridiculous things after a while. Okay, I promise you these will become far more professional as I go along. That is the hope anyway, you know. Okay, so there we go. Ooh, okay. <laughs> right. So then I can see all my papers and I can get an idea of what I want to do with them and apart from that one they're all really quite pretty. So that goes in the bottom of my iris container along with the cardstock add-on which is a little unfortunate, it got a little bit scrunched up in the corner here. So I'm hoping that will sort itself out, you know, once it's sat. A little bit, but hey, it's not a train smash. So I'm going to put that into the iris container and then we're going to get onto the exciting part, which is the embellishments. So hang on, two ticks. Right, I'm back again. And yes, this looks like a shed load of stuff because it is a shed load of stuff. I have the main kit, the embellishment add on, the pocket life kit, the color add on, and then obviously the paper add on. So yeah. There is a lot of product to work with and oh it's so exciting and as this is primarily all that I use when I scrapbook I kind of think it's okay to get everything. So less talking more putting into the little tray and this is where it gets a little complicated but hopefully we can do it without oh I should have cleaned that up a bit shouldn't I? Sister, yeah? Eh, the leftovers from previous stuff. Right, let's just get on. Let us start with, okay, because it just happens to be on the top, I'm going to start with the Pocket Life kit. So we get these Carpe Diem Posh, 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 die cuts. Ooh, includes foil accents. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, so I think for now, for now I'm going to put them in here because I want to be able to rifle through them and see what I have. So that is for now. Enamel dots, also from the Simple Stories Posh collection. Very nice. Enamel dots are always awesome. And I usually, what do I usually do with enamel dots? Well, let's just put them there. Probably change everything around just now. Ooh life cards. I have to say I don't do traditional pocket life or project life. I tend to incorporate these into my traditional 12 by 12 layout. So yeah, but let's have a quick squiz, shall we? Ooh, I do like the colours. That one's pretty. Lots of blues and oranges. 
greens. I like green, I know a lot of people don't, but I like green. So there we go. And, oh, hey, I'm still in September. <laughs> and my daughter turns 21 in September. So there will be a lot of that scrapping now. I think I'm going to put it there for now. Okay, then we have giant numbers. Oh, look at that, 20, 21. I can do a giant 21. It's just like it's all falling into place. 21 and fantastic or something. Okay, let's put them in here for now. And it's, ooh, exclamation mark. Yeah, 21 exclamation mark and. Okay, I can just see the titles coming already. Right, these are super pretty. I have been eyeing this collection, Indigo Hills by Pink Fresh, thinking to myself, I want it. Uh, we'll stick that there for now. They're pretty, aren't they? Really pretty. So, actually, yeah, I can still see it there. Oh, I do, I do like alphabet, so I'm going to keep that aside for now. Um, the colour kit we're going to keep aside for now too. Let's get into the main kit embellishments. No. Yes. Oh, I think, I think this is the main kit embellishments. I mean, yeah, should be. Okay, the posh collection again with some Bradless Brad. Everybody loves a Bradless Brad because you see, so easy to attach to your layouts. I think it can go in there as well. Then I can see that I have, actually you know what I do like doing? I've been doing it lately and it makes life so much easier. I just cut them up because then I can shift them and move them around and I hope you didn't hear that toot because somebody was very rude and tooted. Ah, Maggie Holmes from her collection. Yeah, <laughs> gather, gather from her gather collection. That's right there, woman, honestly. I'm just too excited to get all this stuff out that I'm making a real nana of myself here. <sighs> oh well, you'll get used to me. <laughs> and my nana ring. Okay, so these, you know what? Oh, I don't know, there's quite a few of them. Maybe we should stick them in there, but then I can't see it because of those. I'm gonna put those there for now. Let's get all of these out. Get over there, all of these out. And just have a quick squiz. Oh, that's really pretty. Oh wow, that's huge. What does it say? Gather memories. <laughs> well, of course. That makes sense. Wow, these are quite big. Okay. Very nice for layering and stuff, aren't they? Oh yes, he, he, I suspect, is going to be my nemesis. Oh, he's got a pink bow. <laughs> okay. Um, bear with me. <laughs> yep, lame. Lame, lame, lame. Okay, what else have we got in here? Ooh, more of the Indigo Hills collection, and these look super, super lovely. I don't know how to get into them. Oh wait, there it is. Okay. Okay, jokey, and if you feel like I have a sense of urgency, it's because I don't want this to go on for too long. But these are really pretty. Look at that. Wow. And they actually are really super thin. So let's put them there. Oh, nice. Very nice. Today. Today, today, I've got my kids. It was a happy day. Alright. So those go in there very nicely. Good, good, good. And, oh, we've got alphabets. There actually are, oh, Indigo Hill again. Those are superb. So I'm going to be able to do my titles, and I've got words, words to be able to do my titles as well. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this. That's actually what I do with my my letter stickers as well. It's a trick I picked up from Irit. I saw her do it the one time, and as we all know, I do everything Irit does, because that's just, that's just how I roll. <laughs> And I saw her do that, and I thought it was a very clever idea when it works. Here we go. And you know what I think I'm going to do? I know, I know you're all going to gasp. You are all going to gasp in shock or admiration, one or the other. <laughs> I'm going to cut them up. Because it's easier to store that way, and I can then see what I have. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm thinking these need to go there. Arrows, love arrows. 
those. Come on. Oh, I've got no nails. Oh, go. Get. Oh, okay. Come on. There we go. Yes, I do yell at my supplies. <laughs> when they're not cooperating. Oh, okay, this is where they get complicated, don't they? And you've got to try and get around them and not cut anything. But I love the fact that there are so many. Oh, it's green. <laughs> that there are so many words in amongst all of this because they go with my lovely titles and I get to be creative and think up all sorts of awesome things to do. Okay, well that's not too bad. Not looking too bad, but we haven't finished yet. No. Okay, we've got, I'm presuming this is the posh collection again, we've got some lovely washi tape, some skinny ones and some not so skinny ones. Kind of like me, really. <laughs> They're not so skinny. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go, there we go. Oh, okay. That's nice. Oh, gosh, okay. I think I'm going to put them here. No, wait, maybe I could put them there. Maybe I... Oh, look at that. Not just perfect. Absolutely perfect. And now we have the embellishment kit. More of those. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, we have pretty tassels. Not quite sure what to do with the tassels, I have to say, but um, I'm going to give it my best shot. Well, birthday, birthday, birthday can work. These are so pretty. Those are super, super pretty. They're crepe paper. Ooh, gather collection again. So that's what's nice about the hip kits. You get a real mix of manufacturers and embellishment types and all of that. And you know what? I'm going to. I'm going to. Am I? Am I going to? Yeah, I'm just going to do that. Stick it there. I can see I've got them there. Good. Those are going with that. This I'm going to open. This is probably also the Gather Collection. Am I right? Am I right? Okay. In my defense, it doesn't actually say, but I'm presuming it is. Because I'm not complete ignoramus when it comes to these collections. I know it's her latest one and everybody got super excited about it. So. Yes, so we have pretty bows, we have wood, that's actually really seriously cute, and I'm going to, again, do this, because if I can stop shaking that would be awesome too. Oh dear, whoops, I nearly cut it. Oh, oh, <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe I shouldn't do this. No, I'm going to persevere, persevere, I'm going to, there we go. You knew it was so nerve-wracking cutting these things. Nearly cut the poor little deer's nose off. So that can all go in there. And that goes in there. And I actually probably will do that because otherwise I'm not going to see those. And I've got this little spot. Oh, there we go. Oh, the poor little enamel dots all on their lonesome. Um, thinking. I like to be able to see what I have. Okay, well that's not working, is it? Hang on. These are adjustable. Hey, well, that's not too bad. You'll probably find when I do my first process video, I'll have changed it all around. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to put you, where am I going to put you? I'm actually going to put you there because I want to put this. What are these? Creamies, great fruit, okay. And your anchors away, shimmers, something or other. So that's going there, that we can put there. The stencil, the stencil we can probably put, no, that's not gonna work, is it? Okay, stencil's not gonna work, not gonna work there. We will leave the stencil with this lot and we will now put, oh, oh, I nearly forgot. <gasps> what I do, usually do, but I don't think I can do it with this one is, oh, maybe I can, maybe I can, okay, hang tight, okay, my cunning plan is not going to work, but what I normally do is I actually take all of these off and I put them in here as well, but they've got some quite big ones and they don't pop out very easily, so I'm just going to leave it as a big, big sheet and I will freely admit I think I'm going to battle a little bit with some of these elements because my kids are, are almost adults now so you know teeny tiny dolls and things 
Um, yeah, but uh, and I know I could go back and scrap their their baby or small when they were small, but uh, I've said it before that the quality of the photographs aren't all that nice. So and I like to scrap really nice photographs. So we're going to put that in there. We are going to bring in the alphabets and my stencil. And I'm super excited that we have so many alphabets to play with because I need them. <laughs> and that one's going to go, whoops, the daisy, that's going to go that way. And I'm not so sure I'm loving, I'm not so sure I'm loving this idea. Let's, let's just see, maybe I can get these in here. Okay, they do actually fit in there. Not too badly. Kind of a squash, but that's okay. We're going to squash them in. Squash them in because I like to see exactly what I have to play with. And if I do that, then I can at least see. And maybe, maybe we can do something. Oh no, that's not going to work for me, is it? Just trying to fill up. Just trying to fill up all the little things so it doesn't look, you know. Uh, empty. <laughs> Okie dokie. I'm reasonably happy with that setup. So, thank you for watching, and we'll chat again soon. And I will be up with a design team layout soon. Bye bye.